YouTube, I'm Julia. So you probably have seen some of my other scalloped potato recipes and one I did with half milk, half cream and one I did with probably almost only cream and some cheese in and this here is going to be so so creamy with half cream and half sour cream. It is just going to be so good and this here is the most unhealthy scalloped potato recipe but it is delicious so let's get started. So what I will be using for my scalloped potatoes is some potatoes that I've just cut into some, well, these here. <laughs> and here I have cream and sour cream, then some pepper and here I have some leeks and some onion that I've just cut roughly, some salt and some bouillon cubes or broth cubes. And into my cream and sour cream here I'm just going to add in all of my broth cubes. Then I'm going to add in some pepper. Add in some salt. And I'm just going to place this here over at my stove and just heat it up until the broth cubes are nice and dissolved, but don't let this here boil. And I'm just going to stir it once in a while to make sure that it don't burn. And after that, I will be too. So I have a baking tray ready here and my oven is already at 180 degrees C convection oven. And I have already placed my first layer of potatoes. And now I'm just going to add some onions and some leeks to it. Like that. And then just on with a little bit of pepper. Not too much. And a little pinch of salt. And then the next layer of potatoes. onions and leeks and the rest layer of potatoes And this here is now ready to get into the oven. I will have it, have it in the oven at 180 degrees C convention for about 45 to 60 minutes just until it is nice and golden brown, dark golden brown on the top. And then I will turn down my oven to 100 degrees and just let them be in there, 100 degrees C of course, and then just let them be in there for about an hour more. Then I will take them out and let them cool down for about 20 minutes and then they are ready to be saved. So I really hope you enjoyed the recipe for my scalloped potatoes. It is quite a messy dish but it is just so delicious and creamy. And if you want to give it a go, just go down in my description and you will find all the ingredients down there. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel here and I hope to see you all again tomorrow. Bye!